Ahmed Kathrada was born on August 21, 1929, to Indian immigrant parents in a small town in northwestern South Africa. His activism against white minority apartheid rule began at 17. He became one of 2,000 passive resistors arrested in 1946 for defying discriminatory laws. The African National Congress Party was banned in 1960, and two years later, Kathrada was placed under house arrest. Soon afterwards, he went underground to continue the struggle as a member of the party's armed wing. He was arrested on the outskirts of Johannesburg in July 1963 while meeting with other activists. Their arrest led to the Ravonia trial in which eight accused, including Nelson Mandela, were sentenced to life imprisonment with hard labor. Kathrada was released in October 1989 at the age of 60. He was part of the delegation that led negotiations to end apartheid. Kathrada went on to serve as parliamentary councillor to President Mandela in the first ANC government. In December 2013, he bid his friend of seven decades farewell. Farewell, my dear brother, my mentor, my leader. With all the energy and determination of our command, we pledge to join the people of South Africa to perpetuate your, your ideal. When Walter died, I lost a father, and now I have lost a brother. My life is in a void, and I don't know who to turn to. Thank you very much. Kathrada is survived by his wife, Barbara Hogan, also an ANC stalwart. His foundation continues to uphold his values of democracy and equality. Clementine Logan, CGTN.